What is up guys, Dirk here, happy Thursday. So for those of you in the US, of course, Thanksgiving day. So I wish you a very, very pleasant day. And for the rest of us, let's dive into the charts to see what is happening with Bitcoin and crypto on the shorter timeframes because we are seeing a bit of a shorter term bullish development. So let me share with you what I see and levels that I'm watching to keep an eye on for potential trend reversals. Before we dive into today's content, keep in mind tomorrow is Black Friday. And if you don't already know, I am running a Black Friday special offer where you can join my intelligent cryptocurrency VIP membership for the best and lowest price that it is ever going to be until midnight on Cyber Mondays. So this coming Monday, November 28th at midnight Eastern time, the special offer ends and then I will be increasing the price permanently to be able to join my membership. So if you want to get in now at the best and lowest price that it's going to be, click the first link in the description down below. All the details of what is included are there. You can read the testimonials, dozens and dozens of them. Since we have over 1500 members in our group, there's so much content that has been added this year, so much training. We have so much going on. I share my own personal trades in our discord group you get access to all of that and right now it is at the best deal it's going to be so click that link in the description down below come and join us because it is 100 risk-free i give you a full 60 days to come and join get full access to everything if you're not happy for any reason whatsoever you can simply just email support and get your money back in full without having to jump through any hoops or anything like that but after this monday I will be permanently increasing the price. So if you want to join, I would suggest do it now while the special offer is on. And then you have a full 60 days if you want to decide if you want to stay on or if you want to get your money back. So with that being said, with that out the way, of course, be sure to subscribe, smash the like button. What we have here is the four hour chart on Bitcoin. And as you probably know, if you've been watching the charts the last two days or so, we have had a nice move to the upside. Let me try and explain this, what I see here technically and why I do think there's potential for uh, more upside in the short term. Now, this doesn't mean that we are 100% bullish um, at this point in time. It just means in the shorter term time frame for the next couple of days, we might see more upside. Okay, so why I'm saying that, look what we have over here. Okay, very simple. I put a horizontal line over here and you can see over here we had that little wick just below this low, which means that anyone who managed to even long over here and, and around these levels, this drop over here took out those stops for those leverage long positions. Okay, and that's what we want to see. After it did that, it wicked back up and it started this move to the upside. And as I've explained in multiple videos in the past before, one thing that we tend to see with these kind of moves is that all these highs, right? We have people shorting all the way down because they're expecting a breakdown here and a drop to 12,000 or 10,000 or even lower, okay? So what we have is all these people taking leverage short positions and after this drop here that took out the leverage long of people betting on the opposite direction, now we're going back in the other direction. And I think the objective here is to take out all the stops of people who are betting on the short side, right? So that means we can go here even as high as this wick, which is about 18.1, which you can see over here, 16.7, 16.8, 16.9. So I think we're gonna take that out um, either way. I think we're gonna take out these stops and potentially we run back up to even 18,000 or so. And like I've been saying, there's no reason for me to get bullish in the medium to longer term until we reclaim the breakdown level, which is about $19,000. So even if we get this short squeeze over here, even if we get a smaller rally over here, it doesn't mean we are out of the clear yet. It doesn't mean the bottom is in 100%. We need to get back above at least 19,000 for us to start considering that. Until then though, I do think there's more upside to the shorter term rally. Like I said, somewhere between 17 and 18,000, and I suspect maybe even indeed the $18,000 level. What you can also see here, which is important, the 50 moving average here in blue, simple moving average. I put that on my, all my charts. On the four hour, um, you can see this whole drop, this whole move down since early November, we were below it. And here we tried to get above it twice, 
we got rejected again, which resulted in this sell-off. But now we are sitting on top of it and actually a little bit above it, which tends to be on the shorter term trends, it tends to be a more bullish thing. So that also adds to the confluence of us being able to see more of a rally, more upside in the shorter term. And I'm looking for potentially $18,000 in the next, say, week or so, maybe even uh, sooner than that. And then at that point, we have to reassess, are we going to get a further continuation to the upside? Do we maybe take a run at that breakdown level of 19,000? And if we can flip that, well, then we can start considering a more bullish scenario. But until then, we have to see, you know, maybe even if we run to 18,000 and we reverse back down at that point, we'll just have to wait and see what happens at that point. But for now, in the shorter term, I am looking for more upside here. And personally, just in terms of trading and shorter term trading, I will be looking for long positions on pullbacks in the next uh, day or two. So if we do get a bit of a pullback here, I don't know how low we can go, maybe 16.3, maybe 16.1. If we get that, I will be taking some shorter term trades in the upside direction. So we'll be taking long trades, um, looking to target potentially 18,000. So I just wanted to give you that quick short term update. Um, of course, a lot happens in these markets and these kind of charts, I'm literally sharing this every single day inside the VIP Discord in real time, which is much easier to update, of course, in our Discord chat group. So if you find these kind of videos interesting, if you wanna learn more about technical analysis, how we're trading these markets, and even see which trades I'm personally taking because I share those inside the Discord, come and join Intelligent Cryptocurrency VIP. The first link in the description down below right now is our Black Friday special offer. This expires. This coming Monday on Cyber Monday at midnight Eastern time, after that, I will be permanently increasing the prices. So come and sign up right now. I guarantee it's going to be everything that I tell you and better and that you can get an amazing experience there, all the support you need, content, training. And like I said, it is 100% guaranteed that if you want your money back in the first 60 days, you will get it no strings attached, no hoops to jump through. So this is literally the best deal I can give you at the best price you're gonna get it at until midnight this coming Monday on Cyber Monday. So click the first link in the description down below. All the details are there. Come and sign up for the Black Friday special offer. Join us in Discord inside VIP and I will see you in the next video.